We're self-caring, okay? We've got our robes, Ooh. got our mask. Yeah. We've even got some DIY bath and body products. Yes, and I know what you're thinking. We can't DIY anything. Aren't these the same women who put baby food in their hair down one time? Yes, but today we have some help. Right, Nikki? That's right. Hey. We've invited Nikki from Divine Luxury to teach us how to make these cool DIY bath products. And in this video, you're gonna learn how. So I'm Nikki, I'm the creative visionary behind Divine Luxury Bath and Body. And so today we're gonna be making two wonderful items, a scrub as well as a bath salt mixture that you can use in the tub. So I use two different salts for two different reasons. I use a dead sea salt that's actually from the dead sea. And it contains 10 more minerals in it than a regular sea salt does. So that's nice. gonna help really pull out those toxins in our body. Okay. I also use an Epsom salt because Epsom salt is good for swelling. So if you have like swollen legs, swollen mm. ankles, from being on your feet all day, yeah. And that's going to help with that. So that's why I combine the two to make the bath salt. Nice. Okay. You want to start with about two to three scoops. And so I also have different botanicals that we can put in here. We have rose petals, which are really great for the skin. They help soften the skin. Chamomile is really good for relaxation, and lavender is too. And then we have another one called calendula. Well, so what kind of botanicals do you like, Nikki? I love lavender. Okay. I love the scent of it. Okay, so, so what are like some of the properties of lavender? So lavender is really good for relaxation. It's calming. It's been used since ancient times, and I'm just gonna pour a little bit in here, right? Mm. And there's no set amount. I just eyeball everything, yeah. and then you just mix it together. It makes it look really pretty. But lavender is really good for relaxation. You use lavender a lot at nighttime mm -hmm. to help you sleep as well. Okay, so while Nikki mixes that, tell us more about how you thought of your business and okay. how it came to be. Well, I didn't really have like an Oprah aha moment or uh -huh. anything like that, but I've always wanted to be an entrepreneur and I wanted to leave something for my children. Oh, okay. So I love to cook and mm -hmm. I love beauty. So I decided to go with Bath and Body. Okay. And actually the very first product that I ever sold was the bath salts and my husband bought them from me. So he was, he was, that was my sweet. That's so sweet. He was. I feel like beauty can really make a person feel good about themselves. Yes. And so that's just my way of giving back to women to, you know, help build them up and uplift them. So nice. yeah, and then we all love beautiful skin. So yeah, you know. we do. So this is rose. <laughs> yes, right? these are actual rose petals. And actually rose has been used since the ancient times as well mm -hmm. it helps soften the skin so you can put that in your bath and these botanicals are really good they're not gonna harm your drain or anything like that so yeah just Ooh. sprinkle them all in this yes. is calendula <laughs> I used to call it calendula, but I <laughs> calendula. <laughs> and calendula also is known as marigold this one is really okay. good for your skin as well so like if you have any inflammation Oh, let me get in on you this just action. Give a little dash. Look at that. <laughs> so yeah, it's really good for the skin as well. Like if you have any skin issues, any body acne or anything mm -hmm. like that, that also helps with redness of the skin. Okay. So that's what I'm saying. Baths are everything. Baths should be bay again. So now how we can kick this up a notch is we can add some oil to it. Ooh. And so I have my own bath oil mixture that I make. Okay. And then so you can add a few drops of the bath oil, right? And this has really good ingredients like avocado oil, apricot mm. kernel oil, jojoba oil, and grapeseed oil. And then, so we're just gonna mix that together and you just add a few drops. Okay. And you can also add scent to your bath salt mixture. Which is this right here. Yes, and I have some really great scents. I think Nikki should smell the lavender real okay. quick. Okay, yes, because she loves lavender. Mm. Yes. But lavender is always good, and especially if you're taking baths at night. So you want to start out with a little bit. So we'll start out with about five or six drops. Divine Luxury is actually your side hustle. It is. Right? So it you is. have a full-time job. I do. You're a mommy, mm -hmm. your wife, your friend. So how do you balance all of this? There is no such thing as balance. Okay. <laughs> let's, let's be real. It's, there's no such thing as balance, but I have to find time to do these things because this is something that I love. Mm -hmm. And eventually I want to leave that good government job that All I right. have right. and, you know, do this full time. So I make time. I have to make time for the family, yes. make time for this. And you find where you can fit everything in and you just go from there. So, yeah, yes. there's no real thing as balance when you're a mother, a wife, and an entrepreneur. True, so. true. I don't know if you ladies love vacation like I do, but being laid oh. up on the beach, baby, the, Ooh, the sea salt. salt. Water, yes. yes. Have you ever noticed yes. how the salt water like you does your skin? Like yeah. you come out the water your skin looking is amazing, and you're like, oh my god, it's so soft. Yes. That's the same concept behind taking a bath in the salt mixture. Nice. Oh, I love it. 
is it. This is Yay. yours, Nikki. Oh my God, I love yes. it. No, yes. she yes. needs to get ashy yes, now on honey. camera. Divine Luxury is going to get your life together. Yes. <laughs> so we just finished making our bath salts, and now we're going to make a body scrub. Yes. So essentially the body scrub uses the same ingredients as the uh, bath salt does. Evelyn, if you want to put about two scoops in here, I'm going to add a couple of um, rose buds to this. Not too many because, you know, they're just for pretty purposes. But what I am going to add is the bath oil. And again, remember the bath oil has all the good stuff in it, the grape seed oil, the avocado, okay. apricot kernel. And we're going to add a lot. Yeah, I was thinking, so you add more since it's yes, a scrub. Yes, since it's a scrub. And then we want to add some fragrance to it. And the Revitalize is great. It's a mixture that I made that has eucalyptus, lemongrass, and rosemary. And so those are really good for the muscles. And so you can use the scrub in the shower. Too. Yes, and I always use the scrub the last thing, like after I take my bath or shower, mm -hmm. then I do the body scrub. And then I always start with my feet and work my way up to oh. my heart because you want to get that blood flowing and pumping to the heart. Wow. Yes! It's energy, okay. Yes. It's science. It's steps to this lifestyle. Yes. Now, the thing about the salt scrub is these don't have any preservatives in them. So you don't want to put this directly in your shower. You want to take out what you want to use and then put that in the shower. So like you take what you need out and put it like on a saucer or a little bowl. Okay. And then you take it in the shower with you. So you're going to get you a little bit of scrub. So this is just like you would do it in the shower also. And so what this does now, you see how your hands feel, kind of like just feel how your hands feel before you do your scrub. Okay, Nikki's are probably rough. <laughs> Reptilian. We don't like any crusty hands, okay? And so all you would do is just take the scrub, and you just really want to rub it, rub it, rub it. Ooh, get it in there. And so you just want to do this in a circular motion. And you can see it's really not rough on yeah. your hands or anything. I love that. So yeah, do the body scrub about once a week. You don't want to do it more than that because we do need oils on our body and our skin. And doing scrubs too much can actually dry you out. Yes, look at Ooh. that. You see all of that glistening all over my body. <laughs> yes. Now imagine how your hands feel. Just imagine how your the rest of your body would feel. Your whole body. Your whole body. Yeah. yeah. And then we would just uh, towel dry, pat our hands. Okay. That's another thing. Whenever you're taking a bath or a shower, mm -hmm. don't be so quick to rush and rub it off. Okay. Do pats. Yes. Ooh, so soft. Now that we're all ready to luxuriate, where can people find your stuff? Yes. Absolutely. You can follow me on social media, Divine Luxury ATX on Instagram, Facebook, Periscope. And when you're ready to order some luxurious products, check me out at divineluxury.etsy.com. Awesome. In the comments below, let us know what small businesses you support. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like, share it, and subscribe. We post videos every week, so we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye.